now that Clarabelle has found the volume of this shape right here, I'm going to find the volume of this shape right here. So let me draw that here for you. You have, again, point C, which is 0, and 5.5. 5. And you have point B, which is 4 and 4. And that's our parabola from before. But now we're going to spin it around the y-axis, and it's going to make a spherical cap. So I'm going to... This is the shape. And now we're going to find the volume of this. So before, we found the equation of the parabola BC. And it was square root of negative 32y over 3, just 176 over 3. Now we're going to plug it into the formula to find the volume of the whole thing. And from here, it goes from B to C, which is 4 to 5.5. So it goes volume 2 is equal to pi times the integration of the function squared, which will be negative 32y over 3 plus 176 over 3 squared in respect to y. And it goes from 4 from to 5.5, from b to c. So now, what we're going to do is do pi equal to negative 32y squared over 6 plus 176y over 3 from 4 to 5.5. Now you have to plug in for 4 and 5.5. So that'll be pi times negative 32 and then 5.5 squared, which is 30.25 over 6, plus 176. And you substitute for 5.5 again. 5 over 3. Minus negative 32 times 16, which is 4 squared over 6, <laughs> plus 176 times 4 over 3. Now, if you solve this, you're going to get pi is equal to negative 161.33 plus 322.67 minus negative 85 point thirty three plus 234.67 and if you simplify those you get pi times 161.43 minus 149.34 and that becomes 12.98 times pi and that is equal to 38 centimeters cubed and that is volume 2.